Previously on Castle Swimmer. Ah, the pain! Please stop stabbing me! Oh, it hurts! My blood is everywhere! Good morning, Elder Selkie. <laughs> Actually, it's evening now. The guards just finished patrol. Is that so? I didn't notice how late it was. Yes, our dear prince is taking quite a while, isn't he? Siren has strong morals. He's probably stuck in his own head right now, debating what's right and what's wrong. You think he's just sitting there in silence? Because I'm willing to bet he and the beacon have shared quite a few words. Maybe we should go in there and check on him. That would be against the restrictions set by the prophecy. Oh, right. I forgot. <laughs> Plus, we wouldn't want anyone to swim by and hear the beacon beg for his life. That might give a false impression. You don't have to wait here with me. He'll be out soon enough. You think he'll make another excuse? Most likely, but if excuses are what he needs to get himself through, then that's fine. I can wait a little longer. Or you could just talk to him. Not yet. <sighs> you know, I've been waiting my whole life to meet you. Well, since I was six years old to be specific. That's the first time I was told about the prophecy. Back when I was a pup, I didn't understand about killing or sacrifices. So I was excited to see you. I was never allowed to go hunting or spar with the other sharks. I wasn't even allowed to leave the castle. My one and only role was to sit and wait for the beacon. I used to read all sorts of stories about you, and afterwards I would daydream about what you were like. In the scrolls, you were always depicted as a shining god with multiple arms and tails, but in our murals, you looked like a shark. <sighs> I'm ranting. But what I mean is, I'm sorry if I sound like an idiot. The last thing I was expecting you to be was just a normal person. I always hated being talked to like I'm some special chosen one. <laughs> but I guess it's an easy mistake to make. <laughs> so you never left this castle? Not once? Nope. I'm not allowed to risk my safety by going out. Whoa, that's crazy. So you've never seen a long neck, or a flappy? Huh? Are those, like, jellyfish or something? Wow, I can't believe it. You've never seen a flappy. Siren, you gotta go out and see. There are so many weird creatures. There are these huge swarms of fish. In the distance, they look like big monsters. And there are giant slugs with spikes on their heads. They can suck up sand and shoot goo everywhere. Also, there are long wavy plants that dance around. I call them Wiggle Boys. But they go into hiding when you touch them. So don't touch them. Oh, I forgot about clampers. Those are really cool. There's always something hiding inside them. Siren, you have to go outside as soon as possible. <laughs> Believe me, I've tried. The guards always tell me I can't leave until the curse is broken. Uh, oh. Yeah. The Queen told me about your curse when she locked me up. I've been meaning to ask you. Siren, are the other sharks... Are they all going to die because you chose to spare me? <laughs> 